club of Tesla owners pulled in donations to help to support those refugees. KTV's James Torres reports how a casual car club became a fundraising force. With their lights and a low level of noise, dozens of Tesla cars lined up for a monthly meetup outside the Whisk Creations coffee shop in Alameda. Thanks so much. This is what it's all about. We love you all. Thank you. Thanks to the Tesla owners of the East Bay, donations will head from the East Bay to Eastern Europe hoping to support the efforts to keep people alive in Ukraine. We're not spending money on gas. Let's do something good with that. Peggy Wolf is on the leadership team of the club. She calls the stories from Ukraine heartbreaking. The war is personal for her. My grandparents were from Ukraine and Belarus, or what is now Belarus. Um, I went there on a business trip in 2011, and one of the customers I met with was killed in the fighting the other day. Wow. And so this is personal. Wow. And we care. Care in the form of flashlights, blankets, food. The coffee shop owner is donating proceeds today to the cause. It hurts my heart, but you know, the, the only thing we can do is give back, you know, and this is one thing that they're doing is doing what they can. Um, we're going to do what we can. And the group partnering with Bay Area nonprofit White Pony Express, headquartered in Pleasant Hill. They've already worked on collecting donations and shipping them overseas since the start of the war. Medical supplies are key right now. Tourniquets, bandages, uh, over-the-counter drugs are a big need. Everyone involved today knows it will take much more than these donations to help those in Ukraine, but they hope what they do collect will make some bit of a difference. We're all one family, and um, that's how we look at it. Everything collected today will then be sent over to White Pony's headquarters in Pleasant Hill. They'll coordinate how to actually get it all over to Ukraine. The group says they've already invested more than $1,000 into medical supplies, which they hope to ship out next week. In Alameda, I'm James Torres, KTVU, Fox 2 News.